Welcome. Today we'll be rounding with a vertical number line. This is a vertical number line. It starts with 100 at the bottom and goes all the way up to 200. Each tick mark is 10 points away from the last one. So notice it goes from 100 to 110. 10 more than that is 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190, 200. The halfway point between 100 and 200 is 150. When we are rounding, if a number is less than 150, we move backward or down to 100. If a number is 150 or above, we round forward or up to 200. Let's try it. The number is 120. Notice the dot on the vertical number line at 120. Is that dot below the halfway point or above the halfway point? One hundred twenty is below the halfway point, so we would round to the nearest one hundred, which is one hundred. Let's round one hundred sixty to the nearest one hundred. Is one hundred sixty above the halfway or below the halfway? One hundred sixty is above one hundred fifty, so we would go up to two hundred. Two hundred is the nearest one hundred to one sixty. What about one fifty? The rule is that it's halfway or above, we round forward or up. So one hundred fifty is halfway. So we would round to the nearest 100, which is 200. Notice that 175 is not exactly on a tick mark. It's in between 170 and 180. What is the nearest 100 to 175? Find the point on the vertical number line. Is it halfway or above or below halfway? One hundred seventy-five is more than halfway to 200. So 200 is the nearest 100. We would round 175 to 200. One more. What about 148? Do you see the point on the vertical number line for 148? Notice that it's just below halfway. So the nearest 100 to 148 would be 100. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe so that you'll always know where to find us. And remember, for more math help, you can always go to tinabrigham.com slash math. We'll see you in the next video.